Welcome to UI Infotech channel. For more updates, please subscribe my channel. In this video session, we will learn how to create college effect using Photoshop. It's very simple process. I'll show how to create college effect in Photoshop. Let, without wasting time, let me get started. Let me open this Photoshop here. Go to this Photoshop. And here we need to create a new file. So go to this file, click on this new option, and select this preset as a custom, and provide width and height, set the resolution to 100, and make sure that color is a RGB mode. Why we can always choose the custom here means custom means have more dimensions. So you can give you more dimensions, select this custom, and click on this OK. Now we created this new layer. So when creating the new layer, the first step we need to do here to unlock this one. So double click on this layer, layer get unlocked. Now we created this new layer, and here I'm selecting this rectangle tool. I'm selecting my rectangle. Now select this rectangle tool and start on this rectangle shape. Now just on this rectangle shape, use this move tool. And just this one towards the uh, left side. So we can adjust this one. And similarly, I'll do the same the right damage. Now I start with shift two. Just to use the move tool. We can be Use the move tool. We can move this one. Now I'll make a copy. So hold the Alt button, or else right click. Click on this duplicate layer. Click on this OK. So next duplicate here. Now we created one more shape. Now again you can select this rectangle, and you can you can down. One more shape. Click on the shape. Now we can adjust this one using this move tool. Now we can draw the shape here. Now for the shape one, I'll make it a group here. Now shape two, I'll make it one more group. For shape three, I'll make one more group here. And for this shape three, I'll make one more group. So I'm creating these four groups here. Our first group, we can place image, go to your file, click on this place option and select image here. Now I'm selecting the image. So we have an image as user. Now I'm selecting this image and click on this place here. Now we place the image and click on this enter. Now all right, click and click on this create. Click on the create keeping mask. Now we can create keeping mask. So we can insert the image inside of the shape here. We can also adjust this one using this control transform. So use uh, shift and R. Reduce the size. Like this, and click on this enter. Now, place the image instead of a shape. Now, I close this group one and go to this group two. Uh, go to your file, click on this place option, and select this image. Click on this place here. Now, click on this enter. Right click, rest press, right click. Create clipping mask. You can place image inside of the shape there. Now use this control task. You can reduce the size of this image. Use the shift and hold button. Select any corner of this image. Start reducing the size. Use shift and hold. Select the corner. Reduce the size. Click on this enter. Now place image here. And similarly, now the group 2 is over. 
Now I can give color for this one. Right click, green for this blue two. Right click, orange. And for the group three, select the group three. Now go to your file and click on this place. Click on this place and um, select this image and click on this place option. Now click on this image, right click, create clipping mask. Now use cut or transform for the shift and alt button. Reduce the size, click on this image. So we can increase a little bit. Click on this one. Now we place. Place, place, inside of this one. And next, group 3 is also completed. Right click, give on this L. Now for this group 4, now go to this file, click on this place, and select this image, click on this place here. Now, click on this enter, right click, create clipping mask. Now, you place image inside of the shape there. Now, use a control transform for the shift and down. Reduce the size. Now, let us show it later the simple college effect using the photo.